So I'm going to demo how to find the center of rotation. This question is taken from the textbook page 317 and it's question number two. So we have the object here and that's been rotated to the image there. So what we need to do is find the center. Now what you want to do is find two corresponding points on the shapes. So if I look at this corner here of the object, I need to find the same corner on the image, which is that one. So I draw a line between the two points there. Now there's a technical way to do this using compasses, um, but if you want to just have a go, you need to find the middle of that line. So if I just measure it, it's I can see it's five centimeters long. So two and a half centimeters is there halfway. So find the halfway point. And I need to draw a perpendicular line to that. Perpendicular, of course, means at 90 degrees. So if I can draw a 90 degree line through there, and that's just about right. And that will set me up to find the center right I need to do that again with another pair of corners so let's try this top corner here top left corner there where's the same one on the image so that one will be that one well, that's nice and easy straight down underneath so if I measure those two well I can see how many squares is that one two three four five six seven eight squares so halfway will be one two three four there so draw the line joining them that point there is halfway between so let's do a perpendicular line with that going through there now my two perpendicular lines that I drew they meet just about there so that means that's where my center of rotation is coordinates minus one comma minus one minus one comma minus one there we are good luck